welcome to this lunchtime performance of the Charlottetown Festival's Young Company's production of The Island Waste Management Corporation presents Canada Rocks Garbage! As you eat your lunches and enjoy the day here in this concrete pit during this noontime performance, we hope you enjoy the show! Now, come away with us as we take our garbage truck across Canada to see just how great Canadian garbage can be! And remember, pick up after yourselves! Hi, I'm Alec. Je suis Alec. And look at me, a piece of chewed up bubblegum. <laughs> you all may think of bubblegum as a modern day confection. But did you know, Canada, that in 1534, Jacques Cartier was perhaps the first Canadian to chew gum? It's true! But he didn't have a juicy fruit in his mouth. Ha ha ha! Oh! No, Canada. Cartier chewed pine gum, the hardened sap from trees. Sounds crazy, but the great thing about it was, Cartier knew where that gum went when he was finished with it. Into the compost bin! That's right! But now, now, today, Canadians chew over 210 million pieces of gum a year. Gum, not made from compostable ingredients like pine sap, no, but ingredients like glucose sugar and glycerin, artificial and natural flavoring, soy lecithin, BHT, and FDNC red number 40. What a mouthful of gum! <laughs> oh! But Canada, it's a garbage bin full too. But which garbage bin? I modern-day chewing gum garbage. Am I compost or am I waste? I'm so confused. I know what you mean, bubblegum. <laughs> Hi, my name's Stuart. Je m'appelle Stuart. And here I am, a great big plastic bag of dog poop. <laughs> you know, all over this great land of ours, Canadians are doing a great job walking their dogs and picking up after them when they defecate. Sometimes these noble Canadians use a plastic bag to pick up the dog poop. Big plastic bags of dog poop, just like me. <sighs> but sometimes Canadians can get so confused. I mean, half of me is plastic, which is recyclable, and, and half of me is dog poop, which is compostable. So I ask you, Canada, what garbage bin do I go in? Quel casier d'augure est-ce que j'entre? Je suis confus. Bonjour, Canada. My name is Philip. Well, no, maybe Lee. And I'm a used tampon. Canada, did you know that in 1913, women couldn't vote? It's true. They weren't allowed. It wasn't until 1915 that they got that right. Another right they had to wait another 13 years for was the right to get the disposable tampon invented. Yeah, it's true. Since 1929, disposable tampons, like me, have been filling up landfills all across this great country of ours. The trouble is, with the introduction of indoor plumbing, many Canadian women have begun the practice of flushing their used soiled, blood-clotted tampons down the toilet. Yeah, and still do. Women of Canada, don't flush me down the toilet. I'll clog your pipes. Oh, sometimes people get so confused. If, if only there was some easy way for Canadians to learn how to sort their garbage. So, sort your dress, sort your trash. sort you out. Who and or what are you? I am Father Garbage. Wow. And I live in a magical place between good judgment and common sense. <laughs> Every day, I see thousands of Canadians ignore the simplest of directions. And it makes me so, so sad. And also, also a little bit angry.
Where do you put your garbage, man? Recycle, come on.